Hello everybody, good afternoon. Um, this is Joben, I'm a real estate agent in Dubai and today I would like to discuss about uh, Dubai property ownership types, right? So anybody who is looking to invest into Dubai, um, I, what I want you to know today is that there are two kinds of ownership in Dubai in terms of property. When I talk about property, I mean real estate or land. So it can be land, it can be a property, it can be residential, it can be a commercial property. Now, um, there's what you call the leasehold and there's a freehold ownership. Now, I'll distinguish between the two. Now, a freehold ownership is whereby um, uh, you as the buyer, you become the owner of property and land forever. Okay? So, basically, um, uh, since 2002, through a decree by the current ruler of Dubai and Prime Minister of the UAE, which who is the Sheikh Maktoum Ben Marashid, um, uh, you foreigners are allowed to buy property in Dubai on freehold basis. Right. So um, this kind of ownership, of course, you can buy property in Dubai, but there are, based on this regulation uh, in 2002, um, you, there are 24 designated areas. So in these 24 areas, freehold ownership is permitted. To so you as an investor, you can buy property in these 24 areas and this property belongs to you forever. Okay. Okay. And uh, the second type of real estate you can talk ownership, you can talk about is what you can call a leasehold. Right. So a leasehold is, uh, is also known as a long-term lease. It's very simple. Basically, it's you owning property anywhere between 10 years to 99 years. Right. So you own a property between 10 years. If the minimum tenure is 10 years. The maximum tenure is 99 years. So you own property within this period. And after which time, this property will default back to the original owner. Right, so if it is a commercial building you have or a residential building, after 99 years, this property will go back to the owner. Now, um, uh, this kind of property, this kind of ownership, of course, yeah, is permitted in Dubai since 2001. Sorry, 2001, yes. It's permitted in Dubai since 2001. And so, government of Dubai agreed in 2001 that experts can own real estate on leasehold basis in Dubai. Right. Now, also, you should know there are areas in Dubai which are known as designated areas where this is applicable. So you cannot just come to Dubai and buy property anywhere. So once you are in Dubai, you want to buy property, you should first of all check um, which are the designated areas, you know, but which kind of ownership you want. Is it a leasehold? Is it a freehold? And which are, which are the designated areas? Right. So uh, the major key points I want you to know is that um, um, in leasehold, you own property, but not the land. The ownership is anywhere from over 10 years to up to 99 years. And of course, as a foreign national, you are permitted to enter long-term lease with all properties in these designated areas, right? Now, um, you should also know, as experts in Dubai, um, you are considered a foreigner. But anybody from GCC nationals, who is from the Gulf Corporation Council, anybody in those countries is not considered a foreigner in UAE or in Dubai, okay? Now, um, uh, with leasehold properties, um, or both of them, you have to register them to the Dubai Land Department. In freehold, you have to register to the Dubai Land Department. And in leasehold also, you have to register in the real estate property register in the Dubai Land Department, showing that you own this property and what is the tenure period. Now, another thing you should know is, despite it being a long-term lease, this is also transferable. Say you take a lease for 99 years, and then you use it, uh, let's say you own it for um, 19 years. Uh, for 19 years, you own this property, so the tenure on it is still, there's still 80 years remaining. So within this 80 years period, you can still transfer it, the ownership to your kindred, to your heirs, or to your children. And they also can transfer it until this 99 years is over before this property can default back to the original owner. But with freehold, it is your ownership forever and ever. So I hope this was informative, and I hope this will guide you further in your investments in Dubai. Thank you very much.